Hello and welcome to BioCode. Hope you are doing well. The agenda for today's lecture is protein protein docking using the molecular operating environment software. For this lecture, I have selected the toll like receptor 2 as our receptor protein, and a vaccine that I have designed in my previous study is our uh, ligand protein. So, let's move on to the uh, lecture. First, you need to uh, load the proteins, both the ligand and the receptor proteins separately into the uh, MOE. So click on the open and browse to the folder where you have saved both the proteins, the receptor and the ligand. So here I have saved the ligand and the receptor protein in this uh, folder. Click on the CWD so that the, when you are browsing the next time you will be directed to the uh, same path and you will not need to browse all the way to the same folder. So first I will load ligand protein that is the vaccine. Click on OK and in the symmetry option uh, click on the uh, biomolecule assembly and the drop down list. Click on OK and now you can see the ligand protein is uh, loaded. Now we will go on and load the receptor protein that is the toll like receptor 2. Both the ligand and the uh, receptor proteins are in the uh, PDB format. Click on the biomolecule assembly in the same way open the receptor as well. Now you can see the receptor and the uh, ligand protein both in the MOE. Click on the center on the right hand side uh, bar and you will see the ligand and receptor protein both at the center of the screen. So now we will close the bonds etc. the hydrogen carbon bond. So here you can clearly see the ligand protein and the receptor protein. So go to the systems on the right hand side button to change the colors of the ligand protein. So I will change the ligand color to green and the receptor color will be red would be better I think. So that would be red. So now you can see the receptor and the uh, ligand protein. Before we start the uh, docking of the receptor and ligand proteins, we need to uh, do the quick preparation and the energy minimization. The quick preparation, what actually it do is that uh, it fixes the protonation, it fixes the bond angles, the bond lengths, and other inaccuracies that could be in the structure. So first, we will go for the quick prep option on the right hand side button of the uh, MOE. So here you can see leave all the uh, everything here in uh, as by default. So click on OK and then yes. It will start the quick preparation of both the structures. You can see here the charge issues are uh, fixed, the protonation are fixed. Here you can see protonating system 1 up 2. This will take a moment. Till then we will go to the compute and the side finder option. What actually the side finder option do is that it identifies the active side residues in the receptor protein. So here we click on the atoms in the drop down list we will go to the receptor TLR because that is our receptor protein. So we will click on OK and click on apply. So this is how you can identify the active side residues of the receptor protein and you can use online servers such as cofactor server, cast p server and other related server uh, that you can refer to uh, the lectures on the biocode platform. Uh, so in this lecture we will be using the, the side finder option. So select all of these and then click on the select residues in the SE. So here you can see the residues are selected. The residues are selected and now we will uh, close this tab. Now you can see in the receptor protein that is the toll like receptor the active side residues have been selected. Now the ligand protein will only be docked in this region in the region that we have uh, selected here. Click on the sequence and go over here. You can see the receptor proteins and the ligand protein. The blue, the blue selection you see here that is the active side that we have selected and the receptor. Close the sequence bar and go to compute. In compute, go to dock and then to the protein protein dock panel. 
or you can simply browse from protein and then the protein protein dog here in this section you see in the receptor here you select the receptor atoms by default change that to the uh, tall like receptor because that is our uh, receptor in the side what the side means is that uh, you need to uh, give it uh, either at the all atoms at the ligand atoms at the pocket atom or it may be the residues that you have selected so in this case our active sites are the residues that we have selected so it actually uh, defines where the ligand will be docked so we will click on the selected residues selective residues that means that the protein will be docked and the residues that have been selected are the residues that were uh, identified by the site finder function and now in the ligand we will choose select the ligand protein vaccine so this is our ligand it has been loaded and the receptor tlr has been loaded as well now here from here you can select where the uh, in which folder uh, you want to save the results the output file so i will, i have already selected that so now we will click on run after clicking on run, it is asking me in doc.mdb file exist overwrite so no i will change the file name to one now we will click on run and you can see that uh, the docking has been started over here close the window once the docking continue it will uh, take almost uh, three to four hours so for that we will uh, close the video and come back after the uh, results have completed so we are back with the docking result uh, after the result has been completed i have saved it in the uh, same folder now we will browse onto the folder click on ok and here you can see the doc.mdb this is the uh, docked uh, file complex so we will click on ok and now here you can see uh, the results has been pro, uh, calculated for all the docking complex here are the scores um, the s value the rmsd refine the e configuration e plus e refine flip raw etc and here you can see the 100 different confirmations of uh, protein protein docking uh, calculated by the molecular operating environment software what actually matters is this score the s score matters uh, for us the higher the value is in the minus score the better the docking confirmation is uh, for that we will select the top 10 uh, docking uh, 